Pirita Karani looks very similar to a Sarvangasana, but there is a slight difference in the physical posture. In Sarvangasana, you're, you stand mostly on your shoulders and there is a pressure to your throat as the chin come close to your chest and the spine and legs are at the 90 degree angle to the floor. The weight of the body is on the shoulders. In Viparita Karani, the spinal column is at a 45 degree angle and the feet are slightly towards the forehead. The main weight of the body is on the arm rather than the shoulders. There is also no pressure on the throat as the chin does not touch the chest. This is just a physical difference but Viparita Karani is an attitude of deeper awareness towards the energy impulses in the spinal column which are being carried through the breath so it's a practice in which you are strengthening your energy body so that it helps to prepare you for the practices of higher awareness the solar and the lunar energy frequency are also balanced through this mudra all the mudras of hatha yoga are also the practices of kriya yoga so you should not see the dif uh, different you know they have one and the same purpose to invoke your energy and arise it so that it it can move come closer towards its source